think it's a really tricky area when you consider how, uh, how to navigate the fact that as someone who's working in political journalism, you will spend a lot of time talking to politicians and their staff, not just in professional environments, but social environments too, and making sure that you, you, you maintain a split between those two things. For me, uh, I don't really believe it's a very healthy thing to spend social time with uh, people who are politicians or people who work for politicians. I think it's, it's more important to keep a division between yourself and your life and uh, the work that they do. So um, I think I think it's it's quite hard to navigate. It doesn't mean you can't do it. You need to, um, you know, it's like it's it's similar to the, the impartiality argument at the BBC. What what you do at the BBC when you arrive is you sort of leave your opinions at the door. Similarly, if you have uh, relationships with people uh, who who work for politicians or politicians themselves, you need to try and leave them at the door. That is difficult if you are friends of theirs and people you know, become friendly and so that, that, that is perilous. It also means you might have situations arise which can be uh, problematic. I remember an example of the BBC during the course of a, a sort of argument with, the, uh, with the, uh, the Prime Minister at the time, Boris Johnson, about, about taking part in an interview with Andrew Neil, um, that not only were they not giving us an answer, not only were they sort of stringing us along with the idea that they would do the interview when in fact now we know now they never intended to. They also started to try and stipulate which members of BBC staff they would talk to about this. Um, this was really a, that was really a way, a, te a technique to try and uh, kind of avoid doing the interview and it, was, and it was problematic. So it's really important to maintain the division except you will have some interaction with people and be professional. Um, but I would just say keep your distance.